Hello friends, I hope you're doing great, my name is Melz and today I wanted to go over the topic of the Sephora sale it's incoming, it will start on the 27th of October and when Christmas is so close when I think of a Sephora sale I also envision a great opportunity to get gifts or to treat ourselves, you know. So I will be talking about a few things I see on the Sephora website that I like and I will give you some recommendations. But also I hope that this will help in case you're somebody that's looking for a gift for a makeup lover, somebody who's obsessed with makeup, you don't know what to get them. I know it's difficult to get a stuff for people of the like because they probably have everything you know that they probably have everything and they also tell you that they have everything and sometimes they if they're like me they even buy stuff without telling anybody they just get them by themselves so i see where the problem lies we will be going over some things some new sets something exciting so grab a cup of tea and let's get into it I actually have a few of the new sets here uh, I don't have everything that I would like to have but I have a few let's start with the makeup forever limitless liner set I have this here this is a set of five mini pencils these are can both be used as highlighters or as lip liners and I got this because I have two shades of their pencils of their liners I have endless cacao and wherever walnut and I've always wanted more I always find myself wanting more because they are that good they are very nice lip liners i also use them as eyeliners because the shades are so i don't know they're so unique and so versatile and i wanted more so that's why i got this set these are the five minis that you get they are very small a comparison with one of the standard ones like this is endless cacao and this is whatever this is limitless brown they are quite literally half the size but they do tell you <laughs> that these are minis so you know what you're getting so the shades in this set are wherever walnut which is this shade was made very popular by i think it was ailey bieber in one of her tiktoks and stuff like that she was using wherever walnut this was sold out for a bit and i do recommend this shade it's so good it goes basically with every type of lip color you have because it suits pink it suits brown whatever it it's great then we have limitless brown this is a brown pencil i haven't tried this but um brown is always good you can use this as an eyeliner if you don't like darker lips anywhere caffeine this is supposed to be a cool toned liner so a brown but on the cooler side which is great um, to have because wherever walnut tends to be a bit more pink a bit more warm and then you have two shades that in my opinion you could only use as eyeliners because these are a black and a white so i think these are meant for you know the um, waterline as eyeliners uh, I don't know maybe you could use the liner for Halloween for a black lip it would be a great liner if you like using black lipstick but yeah this, I, this is how I'm gonna use them personally I think this is a great value this is like $35 one of these um, big pencils is basically the same price so for the same price as one you get five minutes i think maybe a bit more like five dollars more you get five minutes i think that's a great deal and you also can not only use this for travel they're super travel friendly but you can see what's the shade that you prefer and maybe you know one day you will get the full size one also can we talk about the packaging for a second if i can get this this is super cute just wanted to say that another deal i currently another value set i currently have here with me is the is saint laurent <laughs> the is saint laurent rouge volupte shine duo you pay this 55 dollars and you get two of their rouge volupte shine lipsticks as you can see here and one of these but 
by itself is 45 so you basically you're paying the second one only $10 which I think is great this set contains uh, two shades one is nude lavalier and one is nude lingerie um, basically it's one it's more pink and one it's more nude and uh, I think that this is great if you would like to share this with somebody or you want to make two uh, gifts for you know your mom and your friend and or maybe your mom and yourself I don't know I think that's a great deal and why YSL lipsticks are their lip products are just top of the line like top shelf lip products so you cannot go wrong with them and here's how they present themselves they are in this black wrapping paper of course you're gonna get the full size lipsticks these are um, a pleasure like these are literally eye candy <laughs> they're so good um i have swatched them this is the shade nude uh-huh doesn't say here 44 but which is nude lava lavalier this is uh seems like a mauve but when you swatch this it's actually like a it seems like a baby pink I don't know it has some move but it's not that deep and then the other one which is supposed to be a nude one it's actually a bit warm on me this is how it looks it has some like uh, you cannot see it from the camera it has some glitters but when you watch it it doesn't I don't know where they go this is the second one as you can see this is definitely warmer and more coral but yeah this set highly recommend highly recommend and if you can get this if you can find this available during the sale uh, uh, enough said you know so let's talk about something new actually this just recently came out it's been a few days makeup by mario has come out with the mini moisture glow on the go plumping lip serum duo how long are these names getting i feel like they're getting out of hand so basically you're getting two of this formula this is the nicest one people rave about this i haven't tried this but i mean you cannot go wrong with those like literally anybody loves them and he's coming out uh, with three shades there's like a bronzy duo a chocolate duo and a more nudie duo and i got this it's in the mail these are 24 dollars and you're getting two minis I think they're great if you want to try their formula, but also, again, great for travel, great for variety, because you're getting two shades. And it's Makeup by Mario's formula, a uh, world-famous product. Just, I cannot wait to get this, because everybody has this, and I don't. And, yeah, I chose the chocolate too. Yeah. Merit also came out with a $39 mini flush balm cream blush set. Now, you really need three mini blushes i don't think you go through blushes as quickly as you can can go through lipsticks but if you're a blush person and if you know that somebody is makeup obsessed here's the thing i think these are great uh the shades are uh, a new shades that is probably limited to this set in particular it's the red shade and then there's fox and beverly hills so you have something for everybody doesn't really matter what's your skin tone this will suit anybody i think feel free to let me know if it doesn't but i have one of these here this is the shade fox which is one of the shades in the set this looks so cute you can directly apply it like this but this is like a perfect shade for fall and for winter it's like a burnt terracotta shade i haven't tried these yet it's this is new but i hear great things and if if you're somebody that likes cream blushes if you want to try merit if you want to have you know more shades of blushes i think that's good so this is 39 dollars it's 63 dollars value so it's basically half the price uh keep in mind that these are minis though now the sephora sale if you are rouge you get 20 percent off if not you get i think 15 or 10 percent based on your sephora ranking but i don't think there's a better time and place to splurge on luxury makeup and i have here the dior backstage eye palette this is in the shade uh -huh, nude essentials so as you can understand it's a neutral eyeshadow palette maybe it's a bit warm tone leaning uh this is this is just been swatched but i have another one from dior i gave that to my mom because it was too mauve for me but this is more up my alley 
uh, I think that Dior formula is very nice, especially in this backstage edition. It also looks very luxurious. So if you want to give something, you know, if you want to get a gift for somebody that has that wow factor, it's a Dior palette. It's $52, but if you get it with the sale, it's less. I think it will turn to be around 40. I think that's a decent price for a gift and yeah, I do recommend this. Also, if you were eyeing this, mm -hmm, it looks beautiful. I can't wait to play with this. I swatched it. Uh, I even like the copper, even though I'm not... It's like a reddish copper, even though I'm not into warm tones lately. I just want to put this all over my face. <laughs> Again, this is the place... So for a sale, is the place for splurging. I have here the Super Nudes Matte Revolution Formula from Charlotte Tilbury. I have this in the shade Supermodel. And this is also a great shade for fall specifically. You cannot go wrong with Charlotte Tilbury lip products. If you are unsure, if you want to get somebody something, maybe Pillow Talk, I would say. But any lipstick here from her is super comfortable. They, the shades are so nuanced. Also, if you were unsure, there's now the famous internet dilemma should I get the Natasha Denona I need a nude palette or should I get the makeup by Mario ethereal eyes palette it's a limited edition it just came back I have had both and I would suggest going for the Natasha Denona I need a nude it is a bit more pricey I have it but um, I have basically reconstructed it with adding different shades from different palettes so it's not the same as the original but um, I have had the Eterialized palette by Makeup by Mario and I decluttered it. I know. Um, the I can see how people are comparing them. They are they basically have the same shades. I think Natasha Denona I think Natasha Denona is a few more, but uh, you know you have the same neutral, the same topes, and they also seem to have the same technology in the shimmers where they are super glittery like uh, you're watching light reflecting over water. I I've tested both. I say that I prefer the Natasha Denona I Need a Nude palette shimmers. The Makeup by Mario Eterialized palette, just the glitters were all over my face and I needed to use glitter glue, which is not... I know, I know it's something you're supposed to do when you're dealing with glitters, but I just can't be bothered to use glitter glue. With the I Need a Nude palette, I don't need to use a glitter glue. They won't move from my eyes. And I also like how... Even though the shades are similar in the Natasha Denona palette, you can still see the different nuances on your eyes. For the Eterialized palette, I feel like the mattes just blend into each other. It looks looks all the same. I was just not happy with it. I gave it to my mom because uh, she liked the, sh the colors. But I would not recommend that one. For a tiny bit more, you can have a better quality palette, in my modest opinion. And, uh, you know, if you get that at the during the Sephora sale, it will be discounted anyways. Okay, one other thing I want to mention. If you like these type of shades that we just discussed, you know, the light reflecting over water type of shades, the wet look eyeshadows, and you have known or you have or you would have would like to try the Space Cowboy eyeshadow shade from Urban Decay. They have come out with the Space Cowboy Moondust palette, which is this one. And basically it's four shades, including Space Cowboy, so you will have a repeat if you have it already. And it's $39, and you have like a champagne one, you have a rosy one, your space cowboy and like a nudie one but this is $39 honestly I think this is such a good product um, it's an all shimmer eyeshadow palette technically but I also think that if you're traveling you know you just put this in your bag and you could also do a one and done eyeshadow look with these easily like and you still get a really really great high look but you if you are just like, if you're obsessed with makeup, you're not just putting one eyeshadow palette in your bag. Like, let's be real. I at least gotta have two to three eyeshadow palettes. So having one completely dedicated to sparkly, yummy glitters and um, I don't know. I, I think it's just a, good, a great palette and I have bought it. 
already because I can't be bothered to wait for the sale. <laughs> Honestly, I was a bit scared that this was going to sold out, sell out because Urban Decay came with another uh, type for this uh, with different shades and everybody was raving and waiting for this particular one to come out so I honestly thought this this was going to sell out until this the sale and you know just I just bought it I just bought it but you can wait I'm sure you can maybe <clears throat> I also will never stop recommending the Patrick Ta major headlines lipsticks these are the just the bullet lipsticks not the liquid lipsticks these last a super super long time on me and the array the range of shades is great well it could be better <laughs> it could be better they have some burgundies they have some pinks um i think they're a bit lacking in the brown department but this line lasts so long they're so comfortable you don't feel them on your lips i have four of these and I gifted my mom one because when something is, is that good, the first person I tell is my mom. And if she won't go and buy it, I will buy it for her. It's that good. So if you need a lipstick, this is good. This is $32, not discounted. And since we are in the Patrick Ta department, the blush duo from Patrick Ta, I have two. And I love them honestly i love both formulations i love both the powder and the cream the powder is a bit more pigmented than the cream they work well together they last a long time on my cheeks which is not unfortunately it's not that um, common with cream products i noticed that a lot of cream blushes tend to just sink into my skin i also have dry skin so my skin really soaks them up but the patikta duo blushes last a lot he also has come out with a palette with three of the blushes and four shimmery shades. Honestly, I don't really like that because it's too Barbie, I think. Not only the packaging is pink, it's fuchsia, uh, but the shades are really, really Barbie doll fuchsia. I just don't like that. But if you see a shade that you like in one of the singles, I do recommend getting that for during the sale. Another thing, and I think I will let you go. <laughs> uh, if you like the I Need a Nude palette and the Makeup by Mario It's Your Lies palette, but you think these are too pricey, just you are maybe just not the type to go for, uh, I don't know how many eyeshadows there are, but it's so big for you, okay? And you want something smaller that it's also cheaper, get the Mini Starlet palette from Natasha Denona. I will grab that, actually. This is neutral but a bit pink leaning with a warm pop with this coppery shade and i apart from this coppery shade all these shades i think that they are actually dupes of what's in the i need a nude palette you can definitely achieve a i need a nude look with this mini starlet palette plus this shade which is called galaxia i'm sure you cannot understand just by looking at this in the camera but this is so nuanced it has it's it has a pink base it seems like a rose gold here if you look at it under different lining it has some blue shimmer it's so unique and it looks i don't know it looks so foiled on the light on the eyes looks so good i really recommend this palette and i recommended it to a few friends as well this is also 27 dollars so with the sale it will be a good deal okay i want to mention one last thing this is not makeup related this is skincare i don't normally go into skincare uh i'm not that big of a skincare fan although i do have a skincare routine i just don't particularly enjoy talking about skincare but this product from Wishful. This is the Honey Whip Peptide and Collagen Moisturizer. It's in their yellow packaging. Be aware of that because they also have uh, something honey related but in a purple packaging. No, this in the yellow one. This is the best moisturizer I've ever tried over the years. It's It feels so good on my skin. It really moisturizes from within. And also, it smells so good. <laughs> I know there's people that don't like fragrance in their skincare. I like this particular scent. It's not bothering me. It's fresh and it's yummy. It's yummy and uh, yeah, I want to heat it, but I also want 
to slather it all over my face so if you're looking for a good moisturizer this is an expensive moisturizer this is like 43 dollars which is crazy for me for a moisturizer i would i will spend 43 dollars for an eyeshadow palette and don't even bat an eye but ask me to buy a moisturizer for that price and i will be mad but during the sale you can restock at a cheaper a more convenient price so I do highly recommend that one so that's it for today's video I hope that you will consider subscribing because because yes <laughs> and I will see you in the next one hope you have a great day bye bye